Hey everyone, this is Under the Covers and I'm CJ. Um, today I'm going to do a, a book buying binge. I went on a book buying binge uh, this past weekend and uh, I'm going to show you guys my findings because I got some pretty good stuff. Uh, first I got I'm Legend by Richard Matheson and uh, some people call it a zombie novel, some people call it a, a vampire novel. Um, if you've seen the movie with Will Smith I guess you can say they're more vampires. Um, I haven't read this book before, but I've heard it's really good. So I picked it up. Um, the other book I got is A Series of Unfortunate Events, uh, The Bad Beginning. It's the first book in the Lemony Snicket series. And uh, I got it for a dollar, so you can't beat that. I also got a uh, bookmark, too, from Half Price Books. Add that to the bookmark collection. Um, another book I got is the uh, third book. It's actually the fourth book in the Resident Evil series. Um, if if you, those of you don't know, Resident Evil, the video game, obviously, uh, they have books to companion the series, uh, the the video games, and uh, this is the third book, but it's based off the second video game, but it's the fourth book in the series. And how that goes is because Resident Evil Zero came out before the first Resident Evil movie, or the first Resident Evil game, and then the book came out, so that's the Zero book in the series. Then Resident Evil 1 is the third, the second book, but it's the first book, if that makes sense. I'm confused, and now you're probably confused too, and I'm sorry about that. But um, I've read the first two books in the series. It's, you know, it's not like, it's not, you know, like, you know, um, elite reading, but it's entertaining and it's fun. So, it's uh, Resident Evil: City of the Dead by S. D. Perry. Um, next book I got was is uh, Parrot in the Oven by Victor Martinez, and um, it's a book one of my teachers suggested to me, and I think I have to read it for school too. So, um, I picked it up. It was only like two bucks, so that's cool. Um, once again, it's Paired in the Oven by Victor Martinez. I uh, won the National Book Award, so that's pretty cool. Um, and the last book I got was Wonderstruck by Brian Selznick. And um, if those of you who don't know who Brian Selznick is, he uh, he wrote The Invention of Hugo Cabaret, and uh, it's now made into a movie called Hugo. Um, you might be familiar with the movie, but um, if you get a chance to read Hugo, The Invention of Hugo Cabaret, I recommend reading it. It's really good. Um, I really enjoyed it. I've read it like four times because it's it's you know this is a big book, right? See how how big this book is, but um, it's actually a really quick read because a lot of it is um, illustration illustrations. And I would show you some of them on here, but my webcam doesn't pick up the um, illustrations that well. So uh, once again, Wonderstruck by Brian Selznick. Um, my review for The Brief Wondrous Life of Oscar Wilde should be up tomorrow. Um, I've been behind with some schoolwork and some other stuff. And um, also, I've been getting a lot of um, rec people recommending me books. On what they you know what they should read what they should recommend so in the next week or so I'm gonna make a video um, you know with some books that I'm re um, requesting to people and from different like genres such as uh, young adult science fiction fantasy fiction nonfiction so I'm gonna do something like that for people who who have been asking for recommendations so stay tuned for that as well and um, Stay tuned for The Brief Wonders Life of Oscar Wilde because that should be up tomorrow. So uh, thanks for tuning in to Under the Covers.